think I would ever share cooking, honestly. Even in Japan, when I was with Bay, she was over at my place, and I was like, oh, hi, I'm gonna make dinner. Do you wanna hang out? And she's like, yeah, like, I, she already ate, so like I was just making dinner for myself. And she was watching me cook. Having someone watch you, I just suddenly am like, I don't really wanna, like, this is too scary. I'm gonna act like I don't know what I'm doing so that she can't judge my cooking skills. <laughs> so I was like, uh, what do you think, Bay? Do, do you think this, this is enough? And she's like, sure. She's like, oh, you could do this to make it better. I'm like, oh my gosh, you're so right, Bay. Oh my gosh, thank you. I realize when someone watches me cook, I just, I know what I'm doing, but I'm like, I, I know what I've been doing, but what if she judges me for what I've been doing? What if I've been doing it wrong? Or what if I've been doing it in a stupid way? And I was literally just making yakisoba. Which is not hard to make at all. Maybe one day I'll have enough confidence to share my cooking. But like I said, my cooking isn't like anything special, but it's not bad. One day. I have to cook for Bay one day. But part of me is like, why would I cook for Bay? Bay could definitely make something better. But Bay's Bay is definitely a better cook than me. Let's cook together. We were on opposing teams. What would it be like if we were on the same team cooking? We're moving now.